blog homegrownhoops.com and today I'm going to share a really simple recipe with you. A quick DIY how to make your own dish detergent. So I have a few simple ingredients here that you probably have on hand. I know that when you start looking into more natural options, one of the first things that I noticed is that it's expensive. It can be really expensive. So I love this recipe because it's super cheap. Most of the ingredients you probably already have in your pantry. And it's also very quick when you have children running around and meals to cook and homeschool to do. You want something quick and simple. So this recipe fits the bill. All right, so I have here a cup of washing soda, a cup of baking soda, a cup of salt, half cup of citric acid, and then lemon essential oil. Lemon oil one smells great your dishes are gonna smell wonderful if that's important to you but also lemon has some amazing natural cleansing properties so all you do is dump everything in a jar not a lot of technical skill going on here you can if, um, if you feel so inclined dump everything into a big mixing bowl make sure that it's thoroughly mixed with no clumps but I don't have any problem just dumping it all in there and giving it a good shake. Okay, so we've got all of our dry ingredients. Now I'm going to add 30 drops of doTERRA lemon essential oil. That may have been 31. Water. Extra drop for good luck. Now I just put the lid on. Give it a good mix. Now I did kind of look as I was pouring things into the jars and make sure that there weren't any huge clumps or anything like that. Just kind of broke them up with my hands. Okay, let's give it a smell. That smells very citrusy and fresh. So all you're going to do is put a tablespoon of this powder in your detergent container in your dishwasher run it as normal and I have noticed really good results with this. My dishes are clean, don't have any issues, no streaks or anything weird like that. So very simple way to replace some toxic cleaners in your home and I did this in a minute. So super simple DIY recipe, very inexpensive and with ingredients that you probably already have in your home. If you're interested in learning about more natural options, and recipes for replacing toxic cleaners in your home, be sure to click on the link in the video below. I also have a lot more recipes on my blog, homegrownhopes.com. If you enjoyed this video and you would like to follow along for more information on natural living, from scratch cooking with a lot of wild game thrown in, and in general following along as we try to build a more homegrown and handmade life, then please be sure to hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Thank you for joining.